nice and quick. You can trust me. Well, I know you're here. No sign of him now. I don't like it. Nat King Cole there. He's just the best, isn't he? Time to reel him in. <laughs> this is Diamond City Radio, and I'm, uh, you know, me, Travis. Just give up. Anyway, there's <laughs> Sheldon Allman, and there's Fallout. There's Fallout. Probably some bad advice overall, but, you know. <laughs>
Undecided by Ella Fitzgerald.
Not afraid of mutants, huh? You're our kind of guy. What do you mean you can't open the gate? Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. Boom. I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. You open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> open this gate right now. You. You want into Diamond City, right? I just got here, but yeah. Shh. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. Sounds good. Let's go. Another great day in Diamond City. Piper! Who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant Mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. Always believed in freedom of the press. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe. Happy? A fine place to come. Spend your money. Settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? I'm sure your city's a great place. <laughs> yeah, greatest house of cards in the Commonwealth. Until the wind blows. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? What is this place, anyway? Why, this is the safest place in all the Commonwealth, with the strongest community and uh, highest standards of living available. We have stores, doctors, schools, power, running water, and the wall as our sacred protector. You'll learn more about the wall soon, I'm sure. But I was talking about you. Come on now, what brought you all the way out here? I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? An infant boy. Kidnapped. Did you say kidnapped? Well, McDonough, Diamond City Security can investigate this. How about all the other kidnapping reports you've been- no, Don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Well, sure. And a mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have time for any more questions. I'm a busy man. Enjoy your stay in our fair city. This is ridiculous. Diamond City Security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security never investigates any kidnappings? I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. 
Hmm, a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. You feel honored yet? Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. Hi there. Free paper to newcomers. If the Institute grabs you in the night, at least we warned you. Piper, you're back. There's a bar in the old theater district that's for Raiders only. A combat zone. I'd stay clear if I was your... Coming to you from, uh... The jeweled green... I mean... The green... Uh, I mean, the, uh... The great green hungry, jewel you can grab of the, the Commonwealth. Of power it's Just Diamond City over. Radio! Next is some... Roy Brown. This one is... Mighty, mighty man. New guy, am I right? Yeah, I'm the new guy. Well, it's good to have you here. Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. Let's see what you have. Self-defense at its best.
Gotta love Betty Hutton, right? in a, uh, a vault suit. I mean, coming out of vault 111. It's the vault 111 part that's weird, I guess, right? I mean, it's not, it's not like no one's ever seen a vault suit before. I, I just, oh. well, anyway, uh, you get the idea, I guess. So let's, uh, Let's go back to the music. Louis Jordan is up next. It's spelled Louis, but don't be fooled. This one I can relate to because I don't like talking to people.
maybe by the ink spots. I know it's definitely by the ink spots. Wait, this is called maybe. I should, I should have been clearer. Coming to you from uh, the jeweled green. I mean, green. Uh, I mean the uh, the great green jewel. Of the Commonwealth, it's Diamond City Radio. Uh, here's Billy Holiday with Easy Living, a song that makes no sense anymore. Welcome to the stream, how are you doing? 